dear friends now i am going to teach you about the foundations how to model the foundations in framework plus okay now we can see same thing again i am doing here first i am checking isometric view is there without creating any other views i am going to model the foundations here first of all i am taking this toolbar here outside place 3d solids okay i am with the uh, with the help of only one view only isometric view i am setting in the both the screens i am going to create the foundations let's see how to model the foundations uh, here this one this one i am going to set right click here top view okay and here i am going to set front view this command i am just changing the top view and front view now i am going to place some foundations here let's see um go to place slab you can see here length width and thickness i am going to create 3 meter by 3 meter by 0.6 thickness here corner center top face or bottom face i am just clicking here okay now you can see the foundation side okay now i place the footing here i am going to model the pedestal next same command go to place slab 0.65 i am using 650 by 650 by depth 1 meter i am going to place in the center here center top face is clicking this center this center accept now in front view you can see okay sorry friends here i place in isometric view i didn't change the top view here so i am setting to top view just placing here okay now it came uh here i'm changing by 3 meter by 3 meter by 0.6 0.6 okay now i am going to click here accept front view you can front view so it is like this i am moving the pedestal from here to here okay now we can see how to model the grout you can see the model how to model the grout first we need to place one 2d square then go to this micro station command offset give the offset distance 0.025 for 25 thickness grout offset this one then select this line go to elevation view move 0.025 you move this in the elevation view now go to this command uh, the solids command click this one select the first line select then select the sec second line then accept you can see 
the solid will create the grout okay friends now we have completed one footing one pedestal on grout you can see in the isometric view okay now you can render you can check it is a solid like this okay friends it is useful i hope it is useful for modeling this foundations now i will teach you one more foundation type like octagon foundation or rectangular foundation form foundation anything you can make just go to micro session 2d here this octagon i want uh, eight sides inscribed if you know the radius you can give uh, for example it's 3.5 meter or something click here you place it correctly or place the octagon first okay then you rotate it rotate this octagon rotate by three points i'm just rotating this point this point and this point i rotated this octagon now this is for octagonal footing i place one octagon for uh, go to the slab okay length width everything you remove only thickness here change to identify element select the thickness select this shape accept accept two times you have to click the left button now you can see this octagon footing has came here now uh, I want to place octagon pedestal also I am changing the I am offsetting this octagon by 2 meter ok again go to slab give only the thickness select this octagon left button accept accept you can see so it came like this now I am moving this element from here to he here so octagon footing and octagon pedestal we have completed here then delete this 2d line now you check render and check this one okay so we now in this tutorial we have seen normal uh, footing pedestal and grout then octagonal footing pedestal okay similar way you just offset this octagon and uh, move by 25 mm above or 25 or 40 mm then if you make a solid octagon grout it will come okay one more foundation is I can teach you it's a circular foundation ring wall foundation first I am going to make a circle here dear friends please listen now I am giving just 10 meter ok um, I am picking then the center draw I am making one line here this is outer dia now i want inner dia inner dia will be uh, 1 1.2 meter some thickness okay now what i am going to do i am selecting this all i am trimming on the other sides so i am making the semicircle okay i made the semicircle now I am connecting with line here line here and uh, now I am going to group this one this one create complex shape I am selecting automatic I am clicking here 
accept 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 so now this one became a group i am just giving mirror for making a opposite circle you cannot make a single circle with foundation so we, we need to develop like this only uh, now i created i am going to slab again i am giving the thickness i am uh, thickness i am giving more for visibility i am selecting this one left button left button again selecting this shape accept 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 now you can see here it came like this because the line one line is here and another line is here wait go here i'm just selecting this element accept i'm just rejecting see here the face is changing top face and bottom face that's why it gone above now i'm giving accept so it came in the down so while placing you can change this top face and bottom face okay so in this tutorial today we have seen normal uh, footing octagonal foundation and circular foundation thank you friends